All right, another day underway here in, uh, where am I? I'm in uh, Richmond, Richmond, uh, British Columbia, which is a suburb of, uh, suburb of Vancouver. So it's a, uh, another day of moving, and um, I'm taking a ferry. I'm taking a ferry from, uh, from just south of here over to Vancouver Island. And uh, I'm going to be uh, spending two nights in the city of Victoria, which I'm really anxious for because uh, I hear it has a lot of uh, English, English influence to it. So uh, having spent a lot of time in England, um, I have a little bit of an idea as to what to expect. And I'm certainly, uh, certainly looking forward to it. So anyway, a couple of things on my mind. You know, you never know what the day holds in store when you wake up. The other morning I woke up, and as I often do when I wake up, I pick this thing up, my, my phone, you know, and I pick it up and I, uh, and I uh, usually kind of check the, check the mail, check my mail, check the news, check, you know, check my videos, what have you. And the other day I get this email from this guy in India telling me how weird I am, you know, a 50... 50 some year old man, sometimes I have to think about my age, <laughs> I lose track, <laughs> but, uh, but talking, uh, so some guy telling me how weird I am, and um, I think he said he likes me though, but, but, he's, but that I'm weird. So you know, I've spent the last couple of days walking around the streets of Vancouver with this little uh, thought in my mind that I'm a weird guy. <laughs> no, I, I'm just teasing. But, uh, but no, but seriously, you know, I, 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 uh, that made me stop and think, you know, when somebody tells you something like you're weird, you know, of course, naturally, you're going to stop and think. He could have said, you know, Tom, you're different, Tom, you're unique, you know, anything along those lines, but uh, he had to use the, uh, the weird adjective. But um, anyway, so I spent the last couple of days thinking about that, and uh, so today I wake up, and there's somebody on, there, there's a couple people on one of my videos talking that I ought to be on TV. <laughs> you know, and this one guy, and, and the gentleman that initiated the conversation says he has connections with uh, VH1. And he's going to talk to some people in the networks, you know, and, 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 and see if he could pull a stringer or two. <laughs> so that thought's going through my mind. Could you imagine me coming to the, uh, to, you know, to the travel channel? Um, but, uh, some of you probably could, but <laughs> anyway, we'll, uh, you know, I just kind of, kind of let go, let God, you know, I don't, uh, I don't worry about stuff like that. You know, it, it's, that's one of the one beautiful things about life. You know, when, when you learn to just let go and let God, you know, life, life just carries you along and, uh, and in the process, it takes you to some pretty wonderful places such as uh, Vancouver Island, where I'm going today. But uh, speaking of wonderful places, you know, my mind is racing on my trip. I've got the next, I don't know, two months planned out. And uh, I swear, sometimes it feels like I'm a man without a home. But uh, anyway, so I have uh, one week from today, one week from today I'll be working, waking up where this trip all started, and that's in Calgary. And I'll be uh, flying home back to Fort Myers if you want to call Fort Myers home. But uh, from there, I'm going to uh, fly with Mercedes and Buddy, and we're going up to Cleveland. So I get in on a Friday, uh, Friday I get in on a Thursday night to Fort Myers, and Saturday morning, the three of us get on a flight and go up to Cleveland. And you know what? I wanted it to be a surprise for my dad because it's his, his, his side of the family's annual family reunion. They have a big big picnic with lots of people and, and and what have you. So I wanted it to be a surprise and show up uh, and show up and surprise my dad. And uh, you know what, I, I, I woke up this morning and I started thinking that, uh, you know, that's another, oh, another eight or nine days away. And although I could surprise my dad, I could re equally surprise him by just calling him right now and telling him that I'm, that I'm coming in. Uh, a week from now. So anyway, so we're going to fly in uh, to Cleveland on a Saturday morning and 
we're going to go to this picnic and then I'm going to take Mercedes and maybe my dad, I don't know about that, but we're going to go up to a place in Michigan, I think it's called Charlevoix, uh, or something like that. It's about a six hour drive. I wanted to do Upper Peninsula, but it's a little bit too far and Mercedes has got to be back to Cleveland for a flight out on Wednesday. So Scott, I think you're up there in, uh, in Michigan, if you have any tips or anything. We've got, uh, we're going to leave Saturday night out of Cleveland, drive about two or three hours, and then we're going to uh, continue on uh, Sunday morning to Charlevoix or something like that. But I'm, I'm all ears if, if you've got any tips, Scott. So let's, I'm going to call my dad and see if, uh, see if I can't get him. It's probably about a little bit after nine, and I don't know how long he'll be able to hear me, but let's see if I can... Uh, See if I can get my dad on the phone here. Hopefully I'll be able to get him on the phone. What time is it there? It's 9.30 in the morning. So let's see if he's around. He'll say hello. Maybe he'll pick up. If I'm lucky. Or he could be out putting up the flag. We'll see. Okay, he usually picks up by about this time. But anyway, I'll call him. Uh, I'll call him later. But those of you that follow me, you're going to get to see Dad again. And uh, not only will you get to see Dad, you'll get to uh, probably meet uh, meet my father's sisters, Helen. Louise, uh, Helen, Olga, and uh, Marge. All right, so there's no answer, but uh, that's okay. So that's enough for today. That's the uh, that's the update on to um, on to Vancouver Island, and maybe the uh, maybe the small screen near you. Who knows? Take care.